I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Queen Elizabeth II. I take three fingers in the center and underneath I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a baby circle. I come on the left hand side and draw a straight diagonal out, curve line down, straight diagonal up, connect, I come on the right hand side, I draw a straight diagonal out, curve line down, straight diagonal in, connect. Come over here on the left and we're going to draw a curve line up, curve line down, connect. Come on the right side, curve line up, curve line down, connect. I come over here on the left and I draw a curve line down. I come over on the right and I draw a curve line down. I come back to the left and I draw a curve line up, over, down, connect. And right here, I'm going to draw a straight line down, curve line over, straight line up, connect. I come back over here to this point on the left and I'm going to draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, connect. I come back over here on the left and I draw a curve line out, curve line in on the left, jump over, curve line out, curve line in on the right. Come back to the left and at the bottom we're going to draw a baby circle. Come on the right, we're going to draw another baby circle. Now we come right to this point and I draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line. Up, connect on the left. A wavy, wavy, wavy line. Up, connect on the right. Come back to the left, we're going to draw a curve line down. Connect on the left and a curve line down, connect on the right. Come inside. One curve line on the left, one curve line on the right. Come back to the left. Curve line, curve line. Come back to the left again. Curve line down, up, connect. Curve line down, up, connect. In the center. Straight diagonal, curve line, curve line. Come back to the left, curve line up, over. Come back to the left, curve line up, over, connect. Now, come over here on the left and just draw a straight line down and leave it floating. Come on the right, straight line down, leave it floating. Come back to the left and we're just going to add a little wavy line on the left little wavy line on the right. Starting right here we're going to draw baby circles across and another row of baby circles across and one more if you can fit it in of baby circles. Okay, come back to the left we're going to draw a straight diagonal curve line off the page. Come on the right straight diagonal, curve line down, off the page. Come up here on the left, we're going to draw a straight diagonal in, straight line out, straight line down, off the page. Come on the right, straight diagonal in, straight line out, straight line down, off the page. Right here in the center, one, two little straight lines. In the background I am going to draw baby circles all the way across, up, down, and around. Keep going, keep going. Let's see, I could put one more here 
maybe one more here. Okay, let's see how we are going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to color, if you have multicultural crayons, I'm going to give her some lightly colored skin tones. Now, if you don't have this, don't worry about it. Just leave it alone. You can leave it white. She looks fine. But I'm coloring this in so you can see what part is body parts. Okay? Then, with my blue, regular blue, I'm going to color in her eyes. And with my pink, I'm going to color in her mouth. Oops, and naturally, I should have known, I forgot two little lines. Straight diagonal on the left, straight diagonal on the right. That's all. Next, with my blue, regular blue, I'm going to color in all of the baby circles in the background. Now, you can color in all of these colors whichever way you want because you are the artist but I am using regular blue to color in my baby circles and I'm taking my time to do them all now this is how you know this is Queen Elizabeth II I'm going to take my blue-green, my turquoise, and I'm going to color in this space lightly with that color. Then I'm going to use the, oops, this should be light too. Then I'm going to use the same blue-green turquoise and I'm going to color in the other part of her space because she always dresses in these extremely bright colors all the way from her hat down to her suit sometimes she'll just have on just a beautiful color in different strengths so she'll have light like the bow is a light blue green but the hat is going to be a dark blue green dark turquoise and I've seen she'll be dressed from top to toe all in the same color. It's very, very impressive. Okay. Then you come down and you're going to do this space. This is her suit. And this is all going to be color it dark. This is the one time where I want you to color dark. And fill this in with a darker version of her bow blue green so if you saw her she would be even her shoes would be blue green turquoise blue just beautiful there she is okay let's see what this looks like all colored in okay here's queen elizabeth ii all colored in ready for an event okay bye bye